really be uh, a fantastic way to end the first game here. I think this teams. is gonna be a race. Because they have like the same amount of gem, going about the same amount of value, so like... But keep in mind that uh, Wave 16 has 18 units in it, so the Doomsday and the Pyros here from the West team uh, will do wonders. And here for Avitas, we got the Phoenix and the Sovereign, which are really, really good on 16. Yeah, but no one's going on 16. They're going 17, and Phoenix sucks on 17. It's like it's worst wave in the whole game, man. But to get the even that the Sovereign, true. like him, I think he's gonna need the Vulcan for next uh, next wave. Man, the next wave. This is gonna be a race, like. 1,000 minus, everyone is at minus 400, we're uh, around so the West 50%. Team, the West team already sent, we got a uh, pack, a mole with a DT from red, and uh, four brutes with a mole from blue. They're still not sending, they want I think they're gonna ease, ease. I don't I think, think that's a might... good idea, man. I don't think that's a, yeah. they should have taken the race, I think. They're really confident. I, I'm gonna follow their confidence, though. <laughs> I'm gonna we, we gotta it. we gotta believe for them. Gotta believe. We gotta believe because if they hold that, it is really low, man. If they hold that, it's not like a crazy sand too, you know. It's well, like I mean, it's full aura. It's annoying and it's a tough leg. Yo, look at that. Man. They don't have. Man. They're they're minus five hundred. So. Eesh, the I don't Vulcan's know. Doing I think Vulcan. they're gonna leave here and die. The Vulcan's doing wonder, man. But e, nah, this is GG, man. They, yeah, should the they should have taken the race. They should have taken the race. This is gonna be one zero one. <sighs> Shout out to everyone on the chat and um, both team. We're gonna see a first winner there. Oh, victory! This is gonna be first game. GG, one zero. Uh, let's see. Damn, yeah, so it's really this, the last time. This is fine taking game one. This was a really interesting game. We're getting to a point. Um, we're going to put the one. Oh. It, it's I would like to. Left side one, so let's put that. Yeah. Yeah, I would like to see um, a, a little change here in the next game. You can um, join the game uh, already. Oh, they already made it. They're not going to take a break. Let's go. Oh. Okay. I am here. All right. So uh, I would like to see a change uh, in the next game. I don't know if... Um, if they're planning to do uh, asynchronic sends, but I would like to see them send together uh, in the early game to try to get as much damage as possible and get the lead here. I think one thing that really caused them also is that they really completely underestimate the race in the end because like his tank was what? It was the, the Yazura, <laughs> which is Swift. He had, yeah, he had the Mudman, the Yazura and the Deadcap. Mudman not upgraded. One mod man, which is like a 120 unit. Got the user on Swift. I mean, yeah, it was. I wouldn't it was have trusted. Grim. And they they got yeah. they um they got for the Phoenix instead of the Vulcan, you know. The Phoenix right, sucks on 17. Man. Let's get into game two. Let's go, baby. Let's see how we're gonna do. But to be honest, on the overall, it was pretty equal. Like. I think the east side went for more jabs and uh, you, you could see the left side was going and taking their time, you know? Yeah, I agree. They're uh, all going the I same like the power. patience. Yeah. I like the patience from the Russian team. Um, it was good, you know? I think it was too, well. too patient from the US team, if I can be honest. Like, I would have taken the race on 17 because no one... Had the fourth tank to you know take on that wave 17 you know yep. like they had a lot of peers to fight it but like 
With your king at 20% on minus 700, I'm taking the race, son. Like, but it, yeah, I think you have no choice. Honestly, I think you have to look at your board and be honest with yourself. You're you're not you're not holding that wave 17. You gotta go for the race because you're gonna lose regardless. You know. But it's oh, okay. We have the uh, cash out holy avenger here. They they or, all went uh, the same power double cash out with uh, chaos and greed. And you see what's the power now? Venture, um, the stab and the hero buff. I mean, this is really good. This is gonna be a good game, man. Yeah, I, I'm thinking uh, here if if I'm um, if I'm gonna be honest, because Dark Ritual is on the table, uh, I'm thinking you want to go uh, into like an early push for workers and kind of catch up on value with the Dark Ritual. I don't know if you saw his build. Phoenix, yeah, Holy got... Avenger, like this guy is he's got a lot of late game. Man. He's got a lot of the game. He's got um, good units to transition well uh, into. Sorry, he's got uh, good units to transition well from one to fifteen. I don't know how I'm feeling about his team past fifteen, but um, we'll have to see what his reroll gives him. I think Gnarl on Chaos gotta be like one of the one of the. The, the best start you can get on Chaos. Because you yeah, can sacrifice it uh, anytime, man. But they're gonna get yeah, the advance on Worker there. And, like He's gonna be able to choose what he wants. Yeah, we see the uh, the Russian team here. Uh, another slow start with uh, Berserker and Holy Avenger. But it's very safe. So, uh, I it's, like to see it's, that. it's tough to make an Holy Avenger leak in the first five six wave even yeah i think i think their their best chance is gonna be wave five uh but we'll see yeah it's the when i when i go on the discord with the other um with the other channel he froze because when i'm in the legion td like uh, my Discord is not selected, so he's frozen. But I do it like as quickly as possible, so he don't froze like for five minutes. You know, <laughs> like he froze like instead like ten seconds, like you say. But uh, thanks for the heads up. That's gonna be something I gotta work uh, before the the next casting for sure. But... Oh wow! Oh, we got, got a, a big here? upset there. Um, oh my god! Yeah. Yeah, you, you gotta build up for wave three, man. Brawl is a natural tank. He 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 does not That's gonna be a big double leak. Oh my god, okay. Oh wow, okay. Okay. I mean they they've gone they're gonna be equal in workers now and man he went minus eighty five on wave three. Eesh. Well it it's not even that. I mean if he had the right units maybe he could hold here. But uh, fortified tanks with natural tanks, they don't they don't do that good. Man, like, it's not for you know it's like T like one unit with okay selling the Gnar for a Yozura okay. You still gotta be minus ninety five there with just six workers. This is a really OP mix to cheese the beginning and mage. Okay, they're set up them for the beginning and. I think yeah, the, the action is going to be around here. Solid here. Sorry. Yeah, I think West Side is really solid here. I think we're going to see more action around the, the East Side. He's going to clear good with the, the Mask, the one. Swift's really good on Impact, too. It's... Next wave's going to be Arsh, I think, for, uh, for our friend here. Yozora tanks 6 pretty well. We'll have Not to see five. if he get more damage. There, no one's saving though. No one seems to be saving. They're sending like one DT. I think this is gonna be like maybe the most annoying way for the Avenger for like a long time, but like this is a really solid start. 
what he has on <laughs> to be honest this is like must be so happy to see like look at this build skeleton <laughs> with phoenix and avenger it's like he, uh, yeah he, he didn't even re-roll yet to run so. oh no he did re-roll i think he re-rolled in the first uh first like 10 seconds yeah. Yeah, yeah this yeah, is yeah, gonna be happen. interesting there natural just like all that pierce damage but they're still clearing pretty decently like the way better breaker, than i thought the old breaker did so much damage yeah like uh old breaker and yozura was like mvp darren yeah that butcher no, killed I, I think sorry go ahead no i am nothing it was a uh... Yeah, I think Oathbreaker on 5 is one of the best units you can have. For its price, it does wonders. Man, they have 80 right now. I don't know on which wave they will... Oh, this seems to be like really hesitating on which wave to go there. Uh, They're just going in, come there. This guy is really below, man. Really, really cool. Honestly, if I'm if I'm the West Side team right now, I'm thinking about sending on uh, probably seven or nine. Like, yeah, nine could do a lot of damage. Nine is gonna be a long wait, but I think you're right. Nine, like, they only have one Eternal Wanderer, but otherwise, the Angler is still a little one with no stacks. So. Yeah, it's gonna be hard to stack him up because he's in start with the angler here. But uh the angler can still be considered a fortified tank. He has a lot of HP for the gold value, so even if he doesn't have the damage, it's not that bad. Yeah, but he's gonna need to upgrade it because the little one is uh Yeah, it's not doing much. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> I mean I think he's waiting on like uh, steed or something. It's like... Well, it might, it, honestly, it might be too late to do yeah, that. Yeah, the wave tree leak was uh, really difficult. They pushed worker, guys. Like, they're trying to push worker and keep their head above the water, but I think they're bleeding a lot along the way. Like, they're, I think they're playing a lot like there's a savior to be taken, but you see them just going comfy. Like, this is income sand, you know? Like, they're getting comfy and on the other side with their cash out. And... Yeah, yeah. I think, in my yeah, opinion, uh, that would have been, like, a king of brain. This was... This was, like, a, a bait send of 60. Uh, with the DT and uh, the snail onto uh, Avitas here. Because they still have a lot of Mythium. And we see they do the imps. Yeah, here. they're going imps for next. Amps tree snail. Okay, I, nice. I'll be I'll be honest. I don't like to see the imps uh, on on wave eight because they're not really tanks. Like they kind of die quickly. Thing is that I would have I would have yeah, liked but... to see uh, dinos or or uh, some something else to tank. You know. Yeah, but look, yeah, and especially they have to bask. There are a lot of impact damage, and I rarely see. I think those two games got me really surprised on how much people actually like spam impact damage like crazy. Man. <laughs> I mean, it's yeah, like, it is true. It's impact damage like all over the field, bro. Yeah, um, but see how they the do. Stand, they're they're the getting destroyed, through? man. They're getting destroyed there. This guy is, yeah, the Pee did a lot there. Antler is also trying to do his best. The, the veterans are pretty good here. He should have uh, he should have paid the twenty gold, I think. Oh, this guy's going out. Out. Oh, I I think I think this is game. Like if if this isn't game, it's like really close. This is gonna hurt. You're talking like it's twenty for twenty percent sure. or something, you know. Eesh. Uh, yeah, yeah, the king's gonna have to fight a lot there. Sheesh. Each. Yeah. Okay, this hurt a lot. They're gonna have to do like a power okay, move or going, something, you know? They're going on the defense here with the king ups. 
Oh, yeah, it's a little... They should have done that. Man, the... I... No. I don't like <laughs> you're, how you're they... Out of words. Yeah, I don't like how they organize their medium because... Like, when you go for King Upgrade, it's like you're going for income, you know? You just go every time you can because it's free gold. Now, you just miss on all the gold. And you miss on, like, five turn of l again, you know? Yeah, and if you're the west side team right now... You're seeing this and you're like, hey, let's push workers, you know. They're gonna push workers. Safe. They're gonna they're waiting for like the bounty of the the wave to push workers. I'm pretty sure yeah, it's starting. Look at this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's just going up. But they're still really good in workers, you know? And they have really good income, you know. So the right side it's just their decision. They just miss a lot of gold for nothing, in my opinion. Though. Well, I, I think what happens now is the west side has it is is kind of overbuilt right now they can just income send and make workers and eventually uh they'll choke out the the east team i don't think they're gonna need like the the i mean they have the gold and i, I like the build like they have things for the later game but mm -hmm. i i don't like that he had the rp and the leviathan you know like he could have gone with the save build of going like the battle cruiser RP, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Like, like he went for I think a more complicated build than what he could have gotten. Like he's got a butcher. It's definitely fancy. He's got a butcher, but like no one's really using the life seal aura. And uh to be to be honest here, I I, I see that there's like a lot of units in play and it doesn't seem like much of their of the units synergize well together. Exactly, that's exactly my point. It's like yeah, you have the antler, the antler is like the slowest lifesteal ever, you know? Like yeah. Fire Lord, you want it in front normally. I think they're gonna lose Darren. Split split time. I think they're gonna something. lose Darren. Uh yeah, it it does it does seem to be the case here. Yeah, it's it's really the wave tree like leak really cost the game there. That's GG yeah. man. GG. Right? That was uh That was a quick two and oh. But uh there there was some there was some good things on uh, on both sides. Yeah, overall, uh, pretty good games. Yeah, I think uh, I like that uh, even with the leak on Wave 3, they still never, you know, surrender and and just try their stuff. We're just going to look at uh, the, the board a little bit. Do we have there other game uh, that we can uh, comment? Let me let me get uh, let me get the discord open and check it out. Let's see that. Shout out to everyone on the chat. Those were big game. Shout out to the winners. Yeah. Should so the winners were Grobian Abuser, correct? Just give me a a, a little second here. Let's see. I'm looking uh, over Discord to see if I can find a game for us. Oh no, the, the team that win is This Is Fine. Sheesh. Shout out to This Is Fine. Um, let's go. They got the game 2-0. Uh, uh, let's see if we're getting yeah. another a game. A 2-0 victory. Uh, they, played, they played pretty solid. Um... I do want to point out on game one, uh, the Millennium placement was a bit off, but it kind of carried the game into the later stages. So that was nice. And uh, very, very good uh, picks on the cash out. The uh, cash out for the uh, West, guy, for the West they were solid. Like me, no, like. They knew they were gonna go double cash out. Maybe they didn't go and see the match history or just didn't really analyze the match history after, but like they went double cash out, you know? So 
you know they're gonna be like super strong on wave one to ten like just seeing the beginning with the dark mage and the avenger and like the leak on wave three i would have gone like king up since the beginning you know like the, the yeah i i agree i think uh i think if you're the the east side uh team and you know your opponent's going cash out uh, and they have a slow start like uh, Avenger Berserker. You want to try to hold with as little as possible and push as much as possible. Get that income rolling, because also, or, el or else you're gonna fall behind. And also like the the butcher choice, you know. Like I think what happened is that he went chaos, he got the gnarl, but once it was time to like switch the gnarl to like a carry pick, he just didn't have any pick to sell it. Yeah, you he know, with, he had the antler and then. It kind of went downhill from there. Because I'm surprised because normally me and my game, like it's always a problem of like wave 13 almost, you know? But mm -hmm. like now there was no fortified tank, no pierce. It was impact like all over the board. But like really the left yeah. side went like carry and yeah. It's, re it's really the wave tree, I think. Like, I think the wave tree completely destabilized the East team to a point where they didn't they didn't really have a plan for the future seeing how they were building they just send income but like you send income you're gonna feed them but yeah we can look so a little I, bit i think the next game Sorry about that. Um, I think the next game should be soon. Uh, we see the number two seed, uh, Dunkler Lord, is going to be playing against This Is Fine, uh, the team that we just casted. All right. That's and uh, on the other side, we got uh, Grobian Abuser playing against Snail Rampage and uh, Bombard Cannons against Rat and Turtle. Uh, we'll have to see here in a minute when we get the news of who's winning uh, the games to decide the next matchup. Perfect. All right. Let's just see uh, who we're gonna get uh, on the casting. Yes, sir. I hope we see like um, like I like the I I like a lot the take of risk to go chaos in a tournament. You know, because me I wouldn't go chaos in a tournament because you know if you get. I think I think it's risky, but it can pay off. That that's definitely the the, the case with chaos, because if you get the perfect picks. Um. You can do wonders with chaos, you know. Yeah, chaos. You know, if you get the picks, like for example, the gnarl. When I saw the gnarl opening, I was like, okay, this guy like is going somewhere, you know. He's got the gnarl opening. Like everything is possible after that, you know. You can just sell it. You can even sell it on wave three, and you're still getting the value on the gnarl. Like I think. Like most people that would go like banana bunk, they're gonna be like gnarl four worker, tank it wave two, sell it, go banana bunk. Like I feel like it just Yeah, there's there's a lot of transitions to be done. Like when he sold the gnarl for the Yozora, that was like a panic move right there. For sure. Because he, he sold the uh, Yozora to wave four, which Gnarl is strong to wave four, you know? Mm -hmm. So they, they sold it to just get weak on wave five where Gnarl would have been good on wave five. Yeah, and, and, and the Gnarl really isn't that good on uh, on wave three, so I don't know. I, I would have I liked to see it played a bit different. Uh, I think we have a game here, uh, Gunny H. It's going to be Void versus Business Casual. Seed 1 versus Seed 9. Do you see it? Yeah, I'm going in. So, we are going to be streaming that game. So, all right. Those guys seems to be like a duo from what I'm seeing. We're gonna put back the point at zero zero. Um, 
Could I do a little uh, custom while they're waiting? Let's see what is uh, the name of it there. So we've got Neil too. So this is business casual. Business casual versus void. All right. Business casual. Uh, void. Thank you, Void, the number one seed. Sheesh. The favorite of the tournament are here, boys. So I'm gonna do text. Just so you guys have uh, more detail, um, Team West. Uh, team West. Uh, change the phone. Just gonna put the normal so you guys don't see me uh oh, i can't think at the same time well you guys will just see me uh <laughs> arrange my can stuff I, can i can i help you with second time third division so it's gonna be team west Dis, t'étais-tu prêt à streamer? Yeah. J'attends. Euh... Just waiting. Hein? J'attends que la game start. Là. And the spectate. Mm -hmm. Front one. Way too big there. Sheesh. Alright. Well, let's get to the game, anyways. Shout out to everyone on the chat. And shout out to every player on the game. This time it's going to be... Um, oh, this is really different this time. It's we, we still got a chaos, but they're pretty much all going greed there. Yeah, we got three greeds and a chaos. Already uh, all the reroll they're getting use. Yeah, and uh, in the spells we see we have a villain, a giant snail, and embargo. Right, you already see this guy is gonna go for the combo with the Leviathan, guarantee him. He's not gonna have a lot of front line, a lot of fortified. Okay, am I already sensing a wave thirteen game there? Shout out to everyone on the chat. We're getting started between it is what seed one and seed six. Seed nine. Seed nine. Okay, yeah, and they, business they, they, casual versus void. And, and they both win game, right? They won one, one series already? Do you have one series in the body? Uh, business casual does. Void starts uh, their tournament here. This is their first game. Okay, and I see it's going to be um, their second oh, time got... for Division 3 tournament. Oh, Gnarl? Got a... Gnarl Millennium yeah, brawl, brawl start? Opener. You think? We'll, we'll have to see. Um... I'd like to see something different. I don't think Millennium is uh, that good in the early game because it kind of needs protection. It kind of needs time to fire its shots. And uh, on the east side, we have... Yeah, double RP. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Wave 13. Huh? Wave 13, Snell. What did you think? Are we going for little prediction there? Uh, if, I had, if I had to predict what's going to happen is uh i'm predicting like a giant snail on 11. you think yeah i think they're gonna do double this, this is gonna be like this guy is missing like a little bit of the combo for the going flying i think but and all rp and this is like uh ah they got the same the same opener polywog with rp yeah though polywog with rp but only one as a leviathan and uh, we see everybody's at like four workers with 11 income. Yeah, you see, he got the Millennium start. Yeah, you're right. You're Eesh. right. We'll have to see how he, uh, how this plays out. 
go see that. He's really going in on the polywog. This guy is more upgrading. He's gonna go for the split. Okay, he's gonna go for the split for his back lane. This is gonna be a dangerous split, maybe in the late game later, because once they finish like the right line that are ranged, they're gonna go like directly on the on the RP there. This I like the positioning. This is a smart positioning right there. With the halo in front, you know, the rat in the back, mm -hmm. and you got the split. Yeah, it's gonna be really solid. God damn, Linium pretty much two shot wave tree. They're, they're, they're starting to say. Millennium is. is... <laughs> Millennium is good, yeah. <laughs> they're, they're already starting to save a little bit there. They have six worker, five. I think they're gonna try to. To rush the game, maybe seeing that they're super weak on 13, or maybe they're gonna work their way so it's, for 13. It's the early game, your East team. When are you sending against uh, Gunny and Royce here? I think they're gonna go five. Maybe, like, thing is that if you wait too much, you're missing so much income. Like five, yeah, six. Is true. I mean, they're they're missing it, on gold. I I think six could be a huge hit. Um, six could be a huge hit on uh, Gunny H here. Shout out to Lord Cracks. Welcome to the chat, my dude. It's gonna be a little late, so I'm just gonna answer you guys on the chat uh, as I see your comment, even if it might be a little late uh, <laughs> when you see it. Right, we got more polywogs coming in. Devilfish. This is like right oh, this is a crazy start right there. This is I like it a lot. Everyone's going like pretty equal. Ah, oh, they're sending. They're sending. Oh what? Oh no, me. Yeah, uh, I, I don't like that. Though. Sending king upgrade weird. and offensive at the same time is like. Yeah, I think that I think that might be uh, miscommunication oh there. But I think what they did, they were like, the guy on the left is not is not gonna leak. But we might like he's not gonna make the guy on the right leak either, you know. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, he's gonna well, leak, but twenty five percent is it, dude. That's that's a yellow leak. That's a win for blue here. If I'm I, blue, I'm happy. I think you either go defensive or offensive, you know. Or you go like income and king upgrade, you know, like you use the gem you have and while you're waiting and I don't know. I think yeah. they just, this was a little miscommunication because you sh like sending a brute just to make leak a 10%. I mean, like you see and, how strong uh, that comp is. Um. The west side here saving their mythium. Yeah, they're uh, starting on. They're going to go... Do you they think They could go nine. on 7, they could go on 8, and they could go on 9. If they go on 9, it could be massive damage. I think they're going to go on 9 because... If they, they go on 9, have... they could hit really hard. Man. Yeah. Swift tank. Swift piercing tank, damage. piercing damage. Dirt. <laughs> and uh, almost, almost everything is ranged. Let's not forget that um, Wave 9 takes reduced damage from range units by 15%. Yeah, it's that's true. Come in, into play as well. They, they're all range. Well, they have the couple melees, but they're going to get pwned by... Thing, I think the, the thing I don't like there is that... Okay, okay, finally. Like, you need the Leviathan on, like, Wave 8 or, like, even before... Like, you, you need... Like, me, the way I like to play my Leviathan is that... I put like them in triangle and then you put three unit on each extremity and they all get double buff, you know? Yeah, like a like a, a crisscross. <laughs> yeah, you, you do like a triangle, but you need to like put your position in first. Like the way he put his RP, like those three I would have put like Leviathan, you know, to get maybe a super RP or something like that. I think yeah, they're gonna get forget, hurt. Then. Let's not forget those are expensive units. So we'll see. Yeah, it's um, true. They've been pushing a little bit too. One, like he's got nine workers already on wave seven. 
they're gonna go on wave nine. You think? Wave uh, nine? No, right? no, they 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 got uh, they got uh, two they dinos go. here. Okay, two dino, three dino. Oh my god, four dino. Okay. Hmm. I, I I like I like this uh, I like this sand honesty because too, huh? you've got you've got giant snails and eleven on the table, so if they can if they can make uh, the east side bleed here, they could transition it could transition well into the wave eleven giant snail push. I think also they can literally go income the whole game, and they're still gonna be okay, you know, because nature mm -hmm. still do good against spears. So. That is true. Like, they're gonna have, like, the dino to... I think wave 9 was a long wait. Like, they're gonna lose a lot of gold at some point. Oh, let's see what how it, how it goes there. They still have the chest there. That's a good investment, but... I think they're gonna get hit. I... Him is gonna get hit, for sure. I like I like the casket and the... Uh, the steed here. Kind of helps them... Uh, yeah, he a sure. little bit. Yeah, no, this hurts too much. And they have no arcane... Like they, they have their late cage of pain, man. Yeah. And now and, they're and, going and, safety uh, mode. They upgrade the king, though. Yeah, at least they have the the king upgrades here. They had a little bit of income advantage, but that's gonna be lost here with this uh, with this giant leak. And we got the advantage <laughs> shifting onto the uh, west team now. Okay, so let's see. We've got two safety mode for wave nine. Easy. Yeah, he's really strong. Gunny is like, yeah, this guy is. Yeah, I'm liking Gunny's position right now. Okay, we see another <laughs> radiant halo, uh, being put down here by blue. Do you think he's gonna risk the the egg this game, or they're just gonna play it safe? Man, I mean. I don't want to see him risk the egg. I think I think it's an unnecessary risk at this point. Uh, you're winning. You're ahead. Uh, I think it could be a troll if if we see him go egg. I think that's that's what I was talking about. You know, they go for an offensive and an upgrade on the king at the same time. It's like you you either what? you know it's left or right. You know, but the shutdown is good. The shutdown is good though. But this guy is not leaking at all, man. He's got millennium, yeah. mage, banana bunk, healer. Oh, I'll, I'll be honest. Arrow. I think I think the east side right now is trying to put pressure and get income at the same time, which it, which is hurting them a lot. Uh, I I'd have to agree with you that uh, they kind of, they kind of need to decide like are we attacking or are we defending cuz right now they're kind of doing a bit of both and it's Me, not working like out. when i look at their team on the east side i see a doom clock like really taking their for wave 13 like they, they still don't have answer for wave 13 they still have nothing for wave 13 yellow yellow has a uh, holy adventure but it's not on the field but not on the field you're right so we'll have to see what happens there and they just got a second art like the doom clock like maybe with the king super upgrade they're gonna be able to keep up like with your team but i've seen so many like and they're saving a lot they already have 140 that means if they save till wave 13 they're gonna have like a four eyes in there <laughs> everyone's saving they have a lot too and they still can do an offensive but this guy is so versatile, man. Oh my I, god. I think I think I think this game's over on eleven. With the snail? Yeah, I think so. If they do both do snail and they do like just a big sand, it's over. Yeah, they go both go snail. <laughs> Everybody's going <laughs> Everybody snail. snail Everybody spam snail. <laughs> all right, all right. That's what I like you, to see. Okay. We're Gaming, guys. <laughs> we're gaming we're gaming everyone's got their their snail it's not it was literally instant click all over the board everyone's got their snail ready yeah. and i really like this move from uh from royce Hellwaka here getting those royal guards in natural defense with a beautiful deflection buff uh, i like to see it we got the banana bunk here this guy has for, everything uh, this guy is like this guy is seeing the future man. 
Yeah. He's foreseeing yeah, the future and, there. Uh, let's see how it goes. Here it comes. I think what happening is that he doesn't know that the Leviathan stacks two times. So. It's not everyone I think, knows I think that. He's just, I, I think he's just like really, really behind on... Uh, They're gonna on get money, hurt there. Know? They're gonna get hurt oh, there. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Everyone's like, getting hurt everybody's, there. Everybody's leaking. Oh it's, my it's God, leaks the, across the board. The 200 snail, 400 snail on wave 11 all over the board, okay. Yeah, and we're, we're gonna see snails all game now. I think it's just gonna be snails. I think it's might be GG, dude. That's yeah. GG. It's GG. Yeah, that's GG. GG on 11. GG. Nice prediction, Darren. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> the snail <laughs> were just too much, Darren. Yeah. The yeah it was, a, it was just... a good game, though. Uh, it was a good game. I, I think predictions were, were on point. Uh, we kind of knew what was going on. Uh, since like wave one, we knew the outcome of the game. Um, yeah, it was it was a good game though. It's one zero for the left side. I I would like to see a little bit of change in the gameplay um, of business casual here. Uh, if 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 I was business casual's coach. I would like to see them either play the income game or either play the aggressive game, but not not both at the same time. I think that's what really hurt them this game. Yeah, like also not go for the same unit, you know, not go for the same core. They went both RP. They know yeah. when to attack and when to hurt them at the same time. Like they could literally save and just attack them at the same time, knowing like it's not like RP is like even if you they would have like for example go both banana bunk you're still gonna be yeah. weak on like six uh, 13, 9, you know like all the forty five. Yeah, if if you play the same team, you kind of run into this issue where uh, you're, you're weak to the game. same waves. But I I think like it, it's really that to hurt them but really to be honest the build that gunny h had there was like very good he, <laughs> i liked it he he was already the millennium and he was preparing his naga for wave 13 i mean he was always well, like, like four, one step 14, in advance 15. yeah 14 know. 15 he was covered you know okay and, so uh, we got uh, the big reroll already man. a big reroll already man. everyone's taking the same Double wisp with the perfect positioning there. Perfect. All right. This guy is like. This guy's I think is gonna be like the surprise of the tournament and <laughs> for Division Three. I think and they're going there, both there plant again. A, okay. I don't. There like is, that however, though. there is a build where you can do um, one atom with triple proton and still hold to a snail on wave one. But uh, double atom also works. This is like the the, oh. the best split you can get on. Uh... Okay, they're going full king income and double plant. Like we we've got we've got a spicy okay. spicy game on they, our hands. Yeah, they're going for for <laughs> fancy and let's go. You love to see it. Let's go, man. All right, I like that. They see that uh, the regular play style wouldn't like work, so they're gonna go fancy. They have both saviors, so I mean, they could go for like, you know, a, a slow beginning, like a tough beginning. And yeah, but honestly, I if if I'm the east side team right now, I'm really scared. They're gonna be like... on three, man. I think. Yeah. yeah. I I don't know about three because three has uh, natural defense, so chloros chloros kind of do a lot of damage. And they already but, sent uh, two on. You're right. But they're gonna have to like overbuild if they go. Like plan's gonna leak. You're gonna leak for sure. Yeah, you're gonna leak plan. for sure. You, you, it's not. It's not a end like they're already you know? saving. You. Know? I think they're regretting not uh, saving their twenty in the early game and just go for DT on wave three. Huh? Oh, they're paying. They know. They know they're saving a little bit. Huh? This guy upgraded. I think he forgot to upgrade at first, and I think they're just gonna play their income game, maybe. But 
Yeah, but yeah, uh, we you see, see already, already leaking. Yeah. It's it's gonna leak for sure. Like, but this is this is good for them. It's like, good. This is a this is a good leak because it's gonna kill the chloro and it's not gonna do that much damage to the king. No, no, and um, they're not losing that much like gold either. Good. Like they're losing like three gold, I think. <laughs> like it's uh, a yeah, six gold advantage. Six. So, so it's three, not, three gold uh, each players. Yeah. But I mean to the player leaking, like he's only because if you leak late game, you're only getting like one gold per minion instead of like twelve, 19, for example. 12, yeah, yeah. Like that, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're losing like a lot of gold. Okay, like they're going like really safe beginning and ninja is like really good for wave five. They're going okay, they're going all in with the plantain. Okay. Oh. Do you think they will go like plant and just try to go double savior and survive? Because like plant on if they save till wave seven, that's gonna hurt them. They they could like literally lose sixty percent of their HP king with no upgrade. You know. Honestly, we'll have to see. There's so many waves you could go on. Okay, seven. and they send the dino here. Okay. I wouldn't have sent a Dino. You see there, I would have sent the Fiend. Because Dino is nature, and they're going full magic damage. You're still we gonna get the have... same value. Well, I mean, we also have Yozura here, which is a swift tank. Uh, it it kind of does well on 4, so I like to see the Dino maybe kill the Yaws. You know? You're not getting too we'll much. Oh, I was looking at the wrong stream there. My bad, huh? <laughs> I thought it was the west side going for the east side with Dino. I was like, dude. No, no, no. no <laughs> it's like, dude, don't do that. <laughs> Please. They're not even leaking. Maybe this. Nah, man, the Wisp is so strong in the beginning. And... Bam. Let's go. Um, Alright. So we've still got a pretty solid positioning there. They're going plant with... I think the big problem here is that he thinks the warg is gonna be like his other tank, but they're still all nature, all weak to the same wave. Like, you're not, like, really adding... Like me, I would have just went for another plant at this point. What is their build? Like, they could do... Normally, what I see is people go plant and arcane, no? Yeah, you like to you like to get plants uh, with arcane defense because uh, they complement each other. But uh, we'll see what he does here. He does have a warg. Yeah, but the uh, warg is nature. Fond. Yeah, I'm not too fond of the warg. Uh, although it's 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 kind of a good tank to be honest. Yeah, but it's um, nature. Do an they're, they're all weak to the same wave. That is true. Like that is true. They're getting sent there. Ah, man, me, I would have waited one wave, just one wave to really hurt them hard because them, they're stacking, man. They're like a hundred of them. And they yeah, don't we'll see, have this arcane. Send might be a mistake. Yeah, this send might be a mistake. I, I agree with you here. I think it's going to make them bleed too, but the, the plants are really strong on that wave, I think. I think they're literally and... the strongest wave they can do. Oh, well, oh wow. Sakura? Sakura. Wow. Yeah. I think it was maybe the wrong thing to build the one because damn. If they would have gone on next wave, I think they would have leaked like 140%, something like that. But no, this but is I'll, still I'll gonna be, hurt. I'll be it. honest. I'll be honest with you. Now that I think about it, I kinda I kinda like the scent. You know why? Because you know your opponent is saving, right? And you see the safety mode here being sent. Oh my so god, you, the you damage is them? unreal. It's unreal. Dude, yeah. I miss my case. What the fuck? And... Whoa. Yeah. I... Whoa. And, and don't... <laughs> Whoa. <Yeah. laughs> it's massive damage. Whoa. Okay, then it was G-Jump 7. Well, no, not necessarily. But but here's what happens. is uh, They undercut them by a lot, right? So this leak to the king gave the west side so much gold that they can hold the next send. From the east side yeah i think also and they're still saving dude like this is gonna be like a mild offense oh no they're going all in they're going all in 
I think also the big thing is that they like expect so much ascent on seven that they were like, we're actually gonna go on six, and they're not gonna expect it, you know. But like also yeah. on your thinking, I think that they they were like be they're gonna yeah, leak the on seven no here. matter what. Oh, yeah. the game's over yeah. here. I this, think uh, Void is gonna close this yeah. out. It, it's it's the it's the first thing we commented is that you can't go both the same build. Like you gotta be really sure if you go the same build because some things like that happen, man. That's gonna be GG for the first seed. Big game there man, for them guys. Sheesh. All right. Congratulations to Void. We'll see in the next tournament if Business Casual uh, decides to come back. Maybe change their strategy a little bit, but uh, they had some pretty good game and nice strategies uh, today. I think they try to to mix it up too much, like going like he should have gone instead of those warg. Even the Sakura, like you build a Sakura knowing that on the next two wave it's gonna be useless, you know. Like you need to build a Sakura on wave one. If they would have both start Sakura, maybe that could have been smart, you know. Not go all in on the plant. Like. The plant you can cheese, but you gotta go like plant arcane, and one of one of you gotta go fiesta, you know, like. <laughs> well, I, I don't think fiesta is like a hundred percent necessary, but uh, it it would help in the case that the uh, chloropixie player leaks a lot, you know. I I think the 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 chloro there, double chloro on um. Let me just change that. Sorry for your freezing camera, my dude. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> I, I think, I think really like the the left side was just ready to go for a one trick, like stuff and all. You know, like you you go for a one trick, you know you're gonna get countered. So you better get like a strat where you you're literally pulling the opponent. I think that was the yeah. thing. It's, it's 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 really what we said in the first game. It's you guys need to like go two different build, and we go on the, on the second build, and it's like okay, we're cheesing with double plants. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it, it, <laughs> it went even worse. It is true. Uh, let's see here. I'm trying to find if we can uh, get another game going here. Um, that, would, that would be a lot of fun I see, like really I think the, the, the first seed like our gunners building I mean I think that's gonna be like the player to beat like you're, you're gonna beat that team by making that guy leak ah, let's go uh, let's go let's go we're gonna see that uh... which one which one which lobby is that rat and turtle versus a grobian abuser I don't see is it this one? No, it's not this one. Let's see. Um, uh, who is hosting? Here? Okay, uh, I'm gonna tell you the name. Um, okay, we've got Grobian Abuser. It's Sky Scatter One L Torten Frenzy. Or yeah. okay, you got it. Wait, I, I'm 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 looking at the the page as well right now. Just tell me the name. I'll join the. Okay. Yeah, I'll tell you. Uh, give me a one. Okay, Skyler, one L, and Rattan Knight, sir, Captain Joker. I don't see their game. Grobian abuser. I. Ah, uh, their player. They uh, already started. Ah, uh, damn man. I damn. think they've already started. Yep. Other uh, game. I mean. I mean, well, if... uh, we can we can comment on the uh, the last game again. Um, I, I've I've seen to notice something um, in this division is uh, the sends tend to be either not together or not the same thing. I feel like a lot of players are uh, doing king ups with their with their uh, sends or uh, not sending together, and that's hurting the teams a lot. Yeah. 
Yeah, and that's something that I really liked from uh, Void's team. Uh, they were sending together and they had solid, solid builds. So. Also, I think uh, the way they build, it, it made them question their send. So it's like, when I'm sending a safety mole, I gotta be confident like, okay, the safety mole is gonna counter that and we're gonna hit them, you know? Because yeah. you're losing income. So when you go safety mole and king upgrade, you're like, is the safety mole really going to do that much damage to the point where you're like, hey, I want to go king upgrade also. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, uh, you need you need the you need the assurance that they're going to leak if you're going to do that. And uh, in the in the case of last game or not last game, but the game before. Actually, both games. Like for, uh, it was it wasn't going to work, you know, because, for example, if done safety mall with you upgrade. So in another world, it would have been safety mall and brute. You know? Yeah. And I think that would have done much better. Yo, thanks, my dude, Nate Duggan. We put on the 31 today, man. Sniper, man, with the real fresh look. Me, I'm going with the more fresh look, more casual. Gotta, <laughs> dress, up, dress up for the occasion here. <laughs> no choice, son. Uh, I think we're getting another game, maybe. Would, we'll it would see. be fun uh, to get I, don't think, I think the finals are tomorrow, though, so... Or the oh. semis and the finals are tomorrow, so we'll have to right. see here. All right. Um, let's see, uh... Maybe we'll catch the next round, um, uh, of the teams that are battling it out right now. I see there's there's three teams that uh, haven't so, been decided. Uh, no games uh, to stream uh, for the rest of the day. We could uh, hit on a uh, series uh, still. Um... <laughs> I want to lurk into any game possible just i want to see uh who are going to be the prospect for tomorrow because what we're going to do tomorrow is we're going to pick our favorite to win the tournament it's going to be a final four we saw pretty much them play we saw half of the team play if we get another game we're just on game one let's okay go. so we have we have another game uh to cast here we'll just wait for their their first game to finish Perfect. Um, awesome. Perfect. But we're yeah. gonna be able to see uh, maybe two other game or one. Let's go. Uh, Gunny, I'm gonna I'm recording the stream, so I'm gonna be posting it um, on the Twitch channel, so you're gonna be able to see um, your whole game and all, and all the casting went. Uh, you're gonna be able to see. They're commenting on your play, man. When we were like, uh, I, I think like, you, you're gonna have to come down with the the prediction and Nostradamus thing. Uh, <laughs> you're like so ahead in positioning and stuff that it almost like outminded the other team there, man. Like every time they're they're like ah oh, we should go there like he's weak there that i i don't know your your role were like role and positioning were mint i gotta take you that uh... okay i think uh we're, we're gonna post it i'm recording me the way i don't do vods me the way i do it is that i record it and then i post it but we're gonna so, post uh... the old vods like i'm gonna not gonna like um do anything i'm just gonna post the buds uh on the twitch and stuff uh, for sure make these i got news here that grobian abuser uh did win their second round or no never mind no 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 they're they're, they're playing right now their second round so we're gonna see uh the game between grobian abuser and uh rat and turtle You know, we're, we're recording this for sure, man. Like, uh, it's a tournament, man. Like, this is this is where, like, the games in Legion... Like, Legion is not a game... Legion is a game for the road of the warrior through blood and tears, man. Now it's tournament time. 
the gladiator needs to get in the arena and, and play it for the Nova Cup. Like, Nova Cup is the tournament where everybody has a chance to shine and in every division and everyone can be a champion. <laughs> it's definitely the time to shine. <laughs> I agree. We're, but um, I think I'm responding on the the chat, you know, so because you guys see it like so late. But uh, we're, we're going to post it uh, for sure. Uh, no worries. Uh, I'm posting it for sure. <laughs> we're going to need to regroup, man. I want to see like all uh, four division and we got uh, the recording. We got the thing like maybe even the... I think you guys like... Gunny, like Gunny's team, I think they were really between Division Two and Three, you know. But I, I yeah, think... they're definitely they're definitely on the cusp. Um, we we see how they play versus uh, the other teams, and and we can we can kind of see that uh, that extra experience uh, come through. So Gorbian Abuser is a favorite of the crowd. Damn. I didn't even see them play yet. Like I'm, I'm pretty much. Uh, I want to see them play now. <laughs> that, that is the next game we're gonna be casting. Oh really? Uh, yeah, the we're gonna nice. cast the second game between Grobian Abuser and uh, Rat and Turtle. All right, let's go. Man. I'm, I'm down yeah. for that. So. Let me just uh, open. My thank you. If you want, you can open the uh, custom games room. Yeah, uh, I, that's what I did. That. Yeah, just to be sure. Uh, so we don't miss it. Ju just open it because me, I, I can't refresh because when I refresh your camera, like, it's gonna I fuck freeze. for like 10 seconds and it's like... <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you're Ackerman going like through left and right Ackerman. all my thing. I'm the Ackerman. I am the Ackerman after all. But th this is gonna be like... Uh, I think we're gonna get like a lot of fun on this tournament. Like I want to see Grobian Abuser. They, there seems to be a hype going in the chat about this team, and I, I, I want to see them play a lot now. I want to yeah, see what I strat they have. See, I want to see um, this is fine's game against the second seed. Uh, this is fine or the Russian team that we casted um, first thing the first thing today. Okay. Yeah, uh, they're they're playing now against the second seed, uh, Dunkler Lord. I would like to see that game. Uh, if we have a chance to cast it, that would be fantastic. I mean, the the double cash out strat is like, it's it's a good strat, man. Like you're you're saving your ass for for the early game and like like just yeah, just the millennium you're, you're positioning, not lose but on, like. Uh... Otherwise, you're not gonna lose on uh, on on weird plays, that's for sure. So I'm trying to see here. It doesn't seem like their game started. I'm gonna message the players and see if they're gonna play now. Right, let me see. Uh, let me get on the Discord. Let's see what's going on there, guys. Um, you know. Well, normally game takes around like 15 minutes, something like that, 15, 20. We don't know if they're going late. Like, if we're missing a late game with a race, it would be sad, you know? Yeah. I still yeah, I still cool. hope they have that, you know, because that those are like the best game and like the most stressful and... <laughs> but yeah, I, I want to guess something. The race, when it's race time, it's a good time. It's racing time. <laughs> Um, all right, all right, all right. Playing against. I'm gonna go see, um, are they back? I see a couple of game getting in, but nothing, uh, really around the, the stuff that we're playing in. So, yeah, we're looking for the Division 3 games. None seem to be available at the moment. Let's see, Grobian Abuser. Man, we really missed them by like 10 seconds now. <laughs> like literally and Sheesh! That's all right. We'll definitely get the next one. So we've got um did they have the same name? Skyler one L 
1700. Man, there was a guy named Wooly McGuire. That's like epic name right there. <laughs> let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, when was the sand? It was okay. It was just like ten minutes ago. When sheesh. Oh, wait. Yeah, well, usually games last like twenty minutes at least. So. Well, we we can start to um. I'm gonna just uh, arrange during that time, man. Just polish a little bit uh, that way. People are gonna know what we're talking about and stuff. Just gonna freeze your camera a little. There. Oh, okay, wait. Am I smiling in the freeze? I feel like. Uh, wait a second. I've done like. I'm too dumb there. Let's go like that. A sniper with good pants. Uh, <laughs> you're completely <laughs> underestimating the dude right there. Whoops. We've got we've got pants. <laughs> you guys want to see how snipe uh, you can do? Yeah, let's. Okay, yeah, I just refresh. You can see the pants. Just do a do, do a little roll and see them how how you dress up, my dude. We see looking fit yeah, got, for uh... the abs. We got the beautiful dress shirt, rolled up sleeves, you know, looking clean. And uh, to match, to match, we got the beige pants, you know, clean beige pants, you know, makes my ass uh, pop out. Beautiful, uh, beautiful pockets in the front. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's it. All looking professional, ready to game. That's how he dress for gaming. Now he's ready. That you know when when we got the occasion to game, we gotta dress accordingly. <laughs> I feel like I've been like putting down the square for like three hours, man. Like I just wanna put like our name on the top of our head, you know? Oh yeah, that would that would be that would be cool. But it's like I swear, dude, I've been. Well, it's a good waste of time, you know. <laughs> it's a good waste of time. Shout out to the viewer <laughs> just witnessing that, but uh, waiting for games and stuff. So why not do that uh, in the meantime? Man, I swear, I've been. It's impossible. Like, you know, I've put this the font to make it good, you know. But like. I swear, like the last seven minutes we've been talking, I'm just putting down the squares with fit the screen. Like it's like it's like a nightmare, man. I think what I'm gonna do is maybe show oh, what the this is too hard. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use maybe a source or oh, I'm already using. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. This is so annoying. Mm -hmm just gonna change them after um let's go with text at source so there's a there's another game that uh just finished we have the results uh Mubud, uh just defeated the warp tons 2-0 and uh are gonna be in the bottom bracket of the uh semi-finals for tomorrow let's go cool. So we got we got two more games uh, that are going to be played out today: uh, Grobian Abuser versus Rat and Turtles, and uh, Dunkler Lord versus This Is Fine. We've yet to see uh, Grobian Abuser and Rat and Turtle in play, but uh, we'll get to that very soon. Okay, I'm almost done. We're going to be able to have our name on top of our head there. And it was like nice. And it's a sniper TV. That's it. Like yeah, let's go like that. 
I think you're gonna see it a little bit late, but I pretty much uh, put our name in red on top of our head. So people know uh, we'll catch it. who is Sniper TV and make these the gamer, man. You guys don't forget to leave a follow on my boy Sniper. This way, Thank you. this way. <laughs> to Sniper TV, my co-streamer. He, he's wearing nice pants and an expensive... It's very expensive clothes and stuff. And... <laughs> I'm I'm glitched again in this stream. <laughs> yeah, but you're gonna be glitched like uh, until I'm able to put the name because you know we're late. But where I am right now, oh, when yeah. it's set it's up, delayed. yeah, it's super delayed. <laughs> like I see it on this at the same time, but because what I did is that I use other source that already have the good font, you know. And I just mm -hmm. changed them to put our stuff in instead of like, I swear I was Making like, I was there for five minutes uh, just putting down the square. It's like there was no end. <laughs> it was like, it was like somebody was missing with me or something. <laughs> it was like, Aah! man, this is a long game and don't forget uh, to not start with. Um, that was the oh, that uh, on the Discord. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Dude, I'm not gonna whisk them in game. Ah! <laughs> no! Killer 1L. We're gonna put it back. Ah, oh, it's uh, it's writing. Let's go. Yeah, they just they just finished the game. Uh, now, so we should be able to join the game now. Hey, was that? Yeah, it's uh, Thornton Fresh. Alright, shout out to everyone on the chat who does stay there. Grobian Abuser. We're gonna be able to see some Grobian Abuser. 1 0 Grobian Abuser. The hype is real, dude! The hype is on. <laughs> so that's gonna the be Turk and Frenzy game. Yeah, going yeah. in. Yeah. Alright, so we're yeah. gonna be switching to the game screen. We're just gonna wait till the people get in so you guys can see our face a little bit more. Get people are getting in. So I see it's 1-0 for, uh, for Tortilla it's one Frenzy. Zero for, All right. It's Grobian Abuser. So that's gonna be uh, the West team? Yeah, the West team, exactly. This is uh, seed number two, if, I, if I'm if i correct. I uh, know, sorry, seed number four. Seed number four, favorite yeah. of the crowd though. Big favorite of the four, crowd. Favorite of the crowd. <laughs> Man, it's too bad they, they we missed the first game. I would have liked to, like you know, first game everyone is more stressed and all, you know, because you're starting your series, you don't know what their guy are gonna be playing. Like second game, you're more prepared, like to do your stuff. I would have liked to be prepared too and see what they're doing a little bit. Oh, the game's gonna be starting, so we're gonna be going on the game directly, my guys. So, the what are the two teams? It's Grobian Abuser versus uh, Rat and Turtle. All right, all right, all right. Let's see what we're getting. Let's scroll back. Okay, okay. Castle cash out. So this is German team versus a US team. Okay. So I think Gunner was like from Denmark. If I'm correct, correct me if I'm wrong. It was like a Denmark uh, I, I US team. That, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, okay. uh, no stress. Yeah. It was the only like half US team we won today. The other we we saw them lose today, man. Against the Russian team. Uh this is fine. Yeah. This is an interesting opening. The guy is cash out and he goes for uh Royal Guard on first. Um I'm not gonna lie, I kinda like it. Royal Guard kinda he tried really to reroll well. there. They, they all reroll. Everyone reroll. I feel like uh, Royal Guard um, does really good. It doesn't really show your cards, and uh, also it allows you to push workers. And we got a plant starter here for a Thornton Press. So any uh, flower. Mm -hmm. I think that's gonna oh. be a tough game for the German team there because. Okay. Damage-wise, 
Thornton has a tough game to play. Like it's gonna, his positioning is gonna be really important with how much damage he possesses. You know. But I know if you saw the power investment uh, allowance, Whoa. I mean, got a lot of eco there. Oh, double Naga there. We'll have to see. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Double Naga on uh, Double Priestess of the Abyss, uh, also known as Pota. <laughs> <laughs> uh, on the east side here by Night Saw and Carpet Jerker 88. <laughs> now you understand, Beautiful, Night Dog, our <laughs> French Canadian think in their mind. This is not the democracy, man. It is the road. The road of the warrior. <laughs> Uh, worker count, we see that uh, the east side is at 5 and 4 versus the 5 and 3 from the west side. I don't know, it looks like uh, it looks like it's going to be a slow game here starting out. It's looked like one went eco and the other one went with a little like fort. I like that beginning, it's a slow beginning but like seahors are really really good. Huh? They're gonna complement a little bit. The only thing I don't like is that they're both nature. It's true, but uh, because in the early game the damage isn't too high uh, from the from the monsters, that that means that the increased damage from being the wrong type isn't that high as well, right? Because like uh, twenty, what, what is it like twenty five percent from magic? Yeah, twenty five percent from uh, from magic damage is not that much when the damage is low so uh, it should survive here against the Man, uh, i would have three. put the priest like more in front though so he tanks a little bit you know yeah uh i agree with you i think i think these pota need to be tanking if you want to make them work yeah i mean she's supposed to be kind of Ooh. strong on this wave because she does magic damage on arcane yeah she's gonna Good, I think. I think she's gonna cheese there. Oh, oh, oh! Ah. We got a leak. All right. Let's see. That's a big leak right there. Fifty percent. I mean. That, that's what it's, I was it's talking expected. about. That's what I was talking about. Both nature. Yeah, it's expected, but honestly, I don't think like it's a it's a problem here. Um, it won't do much damage to the king, if at all. Like, I don't even think it's going to hit the king. It's not going to hit the king. And they're not losing that much gold, you know? How much gold? It, I, it's a 20 gold, but it's nothing, like, alarming. I feel like today, no one wants to put the flower on the main stage, you know? Like, do a build around the flower or just, like... Yeah, but fl flower is really, really uh, hard to play. Yeah, especially I, with I, no I do sorcerer no attack speed buff yeah you're right maybe you want just to put it uh, as a cheese uh, like i said as an opener yeah this guy's already used his reroll by the way 13 frenzy so this is his build for the whole game it's gonna yeah be i'm like... uh i'm definitely worried about the rolls here for the west team uh i think i think that uh torton freeze is he might have like a hard time with damage right, we got a leak there but oh, well, uh we'll see how they send you know like they really went to a different way on their siren build there i like that like they're still leaking you know but i, li I like that uh e. yeah it's a, it's a good thing it's a good thing for them because you don't want them to be weak a week in the same uh Man, look at that damage Like, oh, we've got the first blood there. First blood has been drawn. First blood has been drawn, boys. Shout out to everyone on the chat. Just to get a little perspective, we're getting on game two of this best of three. It is 1-0 for the West team, for the German team. And that's it. We're on we're the second game. We're into the second game. If you're, if you're on... Uh... If you're on the West Side team, what spells are you looking at right now? I think with our games is going, maybe like the thing is that they've got Castle. He's gonna go investment, maybe a long runs. I don't think they've got they can do Davin Blessing on any other unit, and it's gonna be worth it. 
it's True. too I, much I, of I, a double-edged sword. And so allowance to maybe get back from a tough early beginning, but... Oh, is it? Is it that... Uh, I thought that was Pawn Shop. Is it Pawn Shop? Uh, maybe it is Pawn Shop. I'm not... Uh... No, yeah, it. I think it is Bone Shop. All right. Yeah, I, I think we'll see. I'll, I think we'll see investment across the board here. The, I'd be yeah. surprised to see uh, divine blessing. I'd be really be surprised released. if the East team doesn't go investment and go for Bone Shop. Really, really surprised. But uh, so far, we got a, a pretty tight game. It's a, it's a pretty even game. People are pushing. I like that. Uh, like. They didn't send at the same time. That's a little bit my the thing I the don't like there. Yeah. yeah. But they seem to be like really equal. This guy's ten worker. They have the same income. I mean, I think what they need to do is uh, prepare for wave seven. Oh yeah, okay. He's get he's getting okay. He's getting a seven stack cap. That's really good for wave seven. This guy is. I like the positioning and he's got like royal he's getting like a uh, crazy pre-stress. The only thing I don't like, like you said, is pre-stress don't even tank one minion. Yeah, it should it should be tanking. Like it would make their builds so much better. One or two uh, at least. So, yeah, yeah, like a tw twenty percent split. I think that's something they could uh, work on for the finals, maybe. Uh if they if they reach it. They're still pulling like really like good way, but I think like just a little bit because she's still like she's still high value like unit at this point in the game, you know. God damn. Yeah, she's still really strong. Fighter! <laughs> <laughs> All right. He gets it. The king That's still it. hasn't bled there. They're saving. They're saving. They're gonna go for an offensive. You think eight? No, no, they're not. Nobody's. Uh... Oh, they, they're, going now, they're got, going now. They're going now. They're going seven. You got dinos and goals, an exchange of income. Double dino one. Hmm. I like that the dino there one. He, yeah, he's gonna uh, have difficulty there. Really... I don't think he's gonna hold there one. I'd be really surprised. I, I if I if I had to bet I'm I'm, They're both I'm betting that blue leaks but I think Wes blue leaks too do you think everyone leaks them yeah. he's not leaking he's got the cat upgraded is he no it, it seems like Teal will hold like the the West side they're they're leaking for sure. Both oh hey, this guy Ooh. did a way better clear than I thought. Him. And he might even yeah. get the clear, man. Let's go, dude. Thornton Frest did, uh, did fantastic here. Yeah, it's really gonna be... Like, this is still gonna hurt because he's all nature on Magic Wave. But, man, he, he really, like... And the east side held, man. I, I like it. He make me eat my word there, man. Like, they're still... They yeah, got the leak, you know? But... Don't underestimate Pota on Wave 7 and 8. She does wonders. I guess this is the power of the Grobian Abuser there, man. This guy leaked, but it was minus 150, so it was expected. Man, 12 yeah, I and want 11 to see, worker. I want to see what he does here, because he has a low worker count. Uh, and and don't the forget, it's the, the castle, you know? Oh, no, no, uh, I'm, I'm talking about skiller 1L. He's got the lowest uh, lowest income in the game right now. He needs damage, man. He needs to put damage, man. Oh, we see he puts the uh, elite archer here. This is gonna be really good for him. It's true that if they go punch up Mudman, they could do a burst, like almost like a gnarl because you're getting so much of the gold you're spending on. It's it's really a good observation. Yo, that's smart. Arden sell remake. Sheesh. Okay, that's really smart. That's big brain there. If they do that, then shout out to the chat. <laughs> Um, this is not gonna make them leak. I would, I would love to see that happen. Um, but I've yet to see it in my own games. They're so starting I, to I pressure, man. They're starting to pressure, man. 
Like their yeah, pressure is, is getting real and it's a castle run. It, it does seem like the west side here is struggling. And um, the east side also has like more workers, which uh, which kind of makes it so that every time the west side leaks, they're in more trouble. Yeah, they're getting more and more trouble because of that castle. Run. Like they're literally at 15 and 13 worker run. Yeah. I, I think the I think the role that we got on the left side, they're not gonna be able to hold wave ten. Like we'll we'll have to we'll have yeah, to see what we'll happens. have to see him. We'll have to see him. Let's if, be... uh, if I had uh, if I had to bet here, I, I'd bet that the This guy's the saving East already one right fifteen, you know? Right. Yeah, if you're uh, if you're east side, which wave are you sending on here to finish the game? I think it, I think it's a thirteen game, right? It has to be. I think they're not gonna need to wait until there. I think what they're gonna do is maybe an offensive on ten or eleven. I can see that. Yeah, I, I don't can think see they're gonna. Offensive on 10. Ah, they're no, you they're going the offensive. Uh, here. Yeah, they're going on offensive on ten. The witch. He's got a witch and that's gonna hurt him. Who is he sending to though? What does this function do? Mm, Turtan, sending to Turtan friends, okay. This is gonna be a good test for them, I think. I uh, know the the witch the witch is going uh on skiller. <sighs> okay, yeah, that's gonna hurt him. I think Skinner had the good beginning, but like no. Oh my God! Did you see that? Yeah, and we we've got this as well. Okay. Uh, they should be holding ten. Yeah, like... that, that I like that a lot. I think the yeah the Trinity Archer just gonna kill the uh, boss like real quick. So what the hell? And the Trinity Archer is doing a million DPS there. Wow, that's so, it. That is so, so good. Think... I think this is this is They're kind not of gonna a leak. from the east side. Yeah. Oh no, they, they won't leak. They won't I, leak. I think this end was uh, was was bad. Uh, I think if you're if if on nine you see that they have the uh, nightmare and you see they have the elite archer, uh, you kind of want to be careful, you know. Yeah, but I, they, they went with the power move, man. I like how this game is going, and I like how the balance of power just shifted there, and how they. And I, as predicted investment all across the board oh for sure for sure like look at the game is going 19 worker 18 we're just at wave 11 18 14 like no one wants to go on the defensive they want to attack they want to finish yeah. the game man let's that's what i like to see man offensive all yeah, across the board man. exciting game 300 and come that's it we're gonna see some great build maybe the balance of having not that much damage, but a lot of income is gonna be super good for for West team, man. Well, honestly, with the uh, Millennium here, um, Millennium into Doomsday could hold uh, for like he's got Doppel for thirteen, Millennium and Doomsday for fourteen, fifteen. Uh, yeah, we could see a game going very deep. I, I could see this game going out up to twenty one. I think they're going to try to do like, yeah, the banana bunk in front to get the, the aura. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> or maybe they're going to put the millennium even more in front and he's going to get the blessing, you know? Man, this is starting to look really good, though. This positioning on the, the east yeah, side. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't think he's going to give the buff to the millennium. I, I think Chieftain Banana Bunk is just... It's already like Yo, amazing, up. so you, you wouldn't want to change it. This is really smart. I'm gonna use it in my game for sure. That trick, Nathan. Everyone's saving across the board. We've got like crazy, like, gem going on. Man. Oh, what the hell? I don't like that at all, man. Oh, I think that's a big messed up from the side there. Look the at this 140 random. Random. And now everybody's sending like crazy on 13, man. That's a big mistake right there, man. Look at this. 
this is what the sun's supposed to be. Instead, it's going to be that. Because he sent 140 I, uh, on the last. I, I got to say, McDees, I'm, I'm not... Uh, I don't agree with the send here, to be honest. I don't agree with the send, but you know, you saw him send on income last wave, like King Upgrade and the Fiend? Yeah, I, I, yeah, I saw that. That's weird. And actually, what I would have liked to see is instead of doing... Instead of doing it like that, I would have liked to see them both uh, just income sent together. It would have been much better. Yeah, exactly. Like, they know they, they have castle and all, like, and they have 400 income goal. I mean, they can drag the game. But I think they're still going to hit them. And this guy is holding. I I, I'm telling you, the, like... the send here on 13 was not good from uh, from the west side. Yeah, but it's it's really the east side. It's not the west side. Yeah, they really yeah they hold it so easy. Huh? They have a lot of magic damage. No. Look at that. He's got oh, two uh, Azaria. He's got two Azaria, dude. He's not leaking we'll out I'm I'm happy. I'm happy to see that uh, the American team is uh, doing some sort of comeback here. Um, they're gonna equ if they win this game, they're gonna equalize the series one to one, and we'll go into match three. That would be awesome. Yeah, I like to see their comeback, the castle. They're they're really setting up for wave fifteen also. And everybody has a lot of income, man. They're going for like a lot of value on the field. Huh? And I feel like if they would have sent together on thirteen, they could have taken even like ten more percent of the king. But yeah, I I think it's fine. You know, if they go on fifteen here, uh, they will most probably win the game. Uh, we see that Thornton Fresh doesn't really have anything for 15. And uh, a Millennium alone is just not going to cut it for 15. They're going another sun. Okay. A little a little ambitious. I think that's going to take them by surprise there. The think, Trinity Archer, bit, dude. Uh, I think it's a little oh ambitious. I, yeah. I would have liked... Next I would have liked you this know? 15. Yeah, 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 me too. Like, bigger, stronger. They're going to hit them, man. But, like... Not enough. Hey, the man, if they would have went on 15, I feel like they could have hurt them a lot there, man. And we see here the counterattack from uh, the west side with uh, Shaman's Hermit, Safety Mall. All that good stuff. But we'll they're really strong on 15. I... They're not, like... Yeah, they got the Azaria. You double the, Azaria uh, on 15. I mean... Even like all those veterans and Peewees, uh, healers. We got Doppelganger, Arc of Justice. Like, those are all great units. This guy is doing yeah. like... This build is like... Really good, man. It's got like tree split going on. Okay, Doomsday Machine here for Torch and Frisch. Oh, wow. That, that's the power of having 500 income at wave 5. This, I want to see the race, man. I want to see them. This is a big set. Look at this. Look at this, man. They oh want to end the game. They want to end the game. But, ah, man, this is a strong way for them. Let's see that. Oh, my God. Come back. I, this would be, this would be like, they have no upgrade on the king, you know? I, they I, leave, I, I, eat, I, look at this. Look at this. It's I would shredding. like to point out that there's, there's a siege ram that's being sent here for next wave. So if they don't leak here, if they don't no, die no, here, they're I think not leaking. The they're not the leaking. They're not leaking, dude. Look at this. They're... Literally, oh the Azaria God. is made for this wave. She's made for this Yo, let's, wave. Let's go. What a game. Let's what a go. Game. They're fighting. We're gaming here, boys. This is this sieging is a real game. Look at this. They have 518 XN for the next wave. Oh, my God. Double Siege Ram? And it's a swift impact. Like, they don't have any... Ah, they have the Trinity Archer that could be upsetting there. Man, she's ah, uh, it it doesn't it doesn't clear uh all that well on wave uh, sixteen because there's too many units. Man, it's, double it's siege ram centaur. Yo, that's gonna look at this. Look at this, son. And we got another doppel here. All aura with double siege ram. Okay, he's going double siege ram. Oh my god, man. Oh boy! Well, attack we're turtle. To, I would uh, have liked more total siege ram, two siege ram on this wave, though. I think we're about to see the end of the game here. I think the American team is gonna take it with this. Uh, with if this the final German cluster. team hold that, this is gonna be like 
they have so much look at this look at their income no, they're, they're, they're so behind no no they're so behind there I, I there's no way there's no way they hold this yeah skyler fell a little drop. behind there yeah your triple c drum on wave 16 and this is big man this is really big man. Oh, 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 yeah. oh, oh, the Doomsday Machine. Do yeah, the work? Doomsday, my God, what? It's not, it's not going to be it's enough. It's not going to be enough. It's not going to be enough, Because he leaked too much being there too long. Oh, oh, oh. But we have a leak on the east side as well. They and... went for an offensive also, but this is like... Nah, uh, this it's is, not this even is game, a race. Man. This is game. It's not even a race. Look this at is, this. This is game, ah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Game. Uh, GG. GG. GG well played nice. for the American we team. Now... Nice. That was a good comeback. I mean, no, no. Yeah. We're now one and one in this series, and we're going to go on to game three. They went solid. I feel like the German team had no damage on their team. They had no luck. Honestly, they had no luck on the on the picks here. Yeah. I, I feel like their picks were so uh, so hard to play around. Nice, we're gonna have like a game three there. Let's go. Gonna have a game three there. Let's fucking go, dude. The game is up. We can uh we can get into it right now. Yeah, the sand on wave 15. I think I think it's I'm just gonna join the game. Yeah, join join the game before they start. Uh yeah, I, I think you're right. If they did, if they didn't send on fourteen and they send on fifteen instead, they might have won the game right there. Like the Azaria send was like really bold, and it was like against double Azaria, like, and they went hard. You know, maybe with Siege Ram. I don't know. Instead, um... just to soak, you know. I'll be I'll be honest. I think even if they made them leak, they wouldn't have won the game. It wouldn't have been enough on fifteen. Like, like I think the German team had to race them on sixteen if they wanted to win, and they had to race them like with a big all in. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, it's really the the DPS like DPS also and. Like, when you saw him cash out start with a Royal Guard, you like, okay, doesn't have that much DPS, you know. He had, he had the Disciple, you know. Disciple can do really had, good 1-2-3. The... Huh? I mean, Disciple kind of kind of uh, shifts well into the late game. So, uh, I really I really like Disciple. I would have liked to see him play it, but it, it's not an easy play, you know. It's, it's, not, it's not something that's, like, very natural for a lot of players. Yeah, so, but uh, I can't, I kind of understand it, you know. Understand too, but like on wave three, I think what set up the game for them, especially they're going against a castle. They don't know they're going against a castle, you know. But that's something like we didn't see the first game, so we don't know if they know the info, you know. Well, people switch uh, masterminds, so I mean, even if you uh, even if you go into the last match, you're not a hundred percent sure. I like we didn't um, see the first game, but I think what happened is that the on the first game they didn't go castle. Then on the second game they're like, okay, they're playing like that. We're gonna go castle. We we can definitely check it out. Um, can, after can, you know. Ah, uh, yeah, it's true. You're in the game with me, <laughs> but I can. You can check it in the game. You know. No, it's gonna start. I I will. I'll I'll go check it out uh, during the game. Because. Like, I think Wave 3 really set up the game for the castle team. You know? Because they were already a little behind. And it's a castle. You know he's going for a late game. He's going for income. Like, I liked how the game was. We're going income. You're going income. We're both going to be super strong. Yeah, a lot yeah. of workers, a lot of income, a lot of a lot of uh, everything. Honestly, like Grover and Abuser, they old well. They just like you have the gold, but you have nothing to spend it on. That that's really where their problem. I think. Uh, I like uh, I like the um, the beautiful comments from uh, Eskimo. 
He's like number one. Look at his fan bad RG. <laughs> <laughs> Everything happened there. But it's really the unit, to be honest, like, especially going against a castle, it's like, they, they would have need to finish quick. But I like how they shift, you know, they add double siren and they still manage to do, like, a really good, completely two different builds, you know? One went really a lot siren, and. Okay. Same. We got the. Allowance. The same masterminds. Press the medium or allowance, you think, this game? Or lizard how they uh, play. let's see let's see how it goes you know uh we want to we want to see their builds and uh you know what they decide to do here but i'm i'm expecting a lot of aggressiveness with uh pta press the attack or everyone's uh, re-rolling one everyone is rolling okay okay now they have dps they have they have something like everyone used a re-roll Wave one after ten seconds, it's reroll time. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would like to. I would like to see them use it a bit later to see what they're missing out on. But uh, yeah, like the castle build is a cheap build. Oh, we we got a we got a forward butcher here for uh, Thornton Priest. I think he's gonna try to set up something with the boar. It's the boar, yeah, uh, yeah. We're looking at a boar setup here. Uh, we got the antler opener for Skiller 1L. I think he uh, likes to start pre stress. <laughs> like, what I yeah, like about yeah. Carpet is that um, he has low unit, but he has the everything to do a flying unit combo. Yeah, just, just no, like. He's got, he's got the Levi, he's got the Harpies, he's got the Steeds for mana. Um, the only issue here is, uh, is he going to under... Um, I mean, is he is he going to build tanks? Because uh, if you don't build tanks with Levi and Harpy, um, you're going to have a, a hard time. But well, he does have fortified and nature tanks, so... He has we'll, fortified, we'll he has nature, and he has the swift also. Like, if you oh, do meet shield... And and he has arcane with the steed, so uh, yeah. And yeah, like maybe if he does a combo where there's not a lot of RP, and then there's steeds, and then that RP get super boosted. Then again, I think yeah, I really want to see like when you got the cheap build, it's it's fun to see the quantity, you know. Mm -hmm. So sometimes though it can it can come back and hunt you. We'll we'll have to see how it plays out. Honestly, I'm I'm liking the start from both teams this game. It is final game, so whoever's like taking the W here is going for the semifinal tomorrow, and it's really in or out right now. So yeah, and uh, I believe they're going to be playing against Void tomorrow. Oh, so that's the nice. winner. The winner of this series is going to be against Void, so uh, they got to come prepared. Okay, we see a slow. St oh my God, we see a slow start pushing some workers left and right. Is the antler antler and just a pee on wave tree? I'd like to. I'd like to bring your attention to uh, carpet's medium. Yeah, he hasn't sent anything all game. Damn. Are we gonna see a brute on three? No. No. Still, still saving. saving. Who is he sending to? Um, uh, he's sending to Torton. <coughs> oh. No, to Jerker. Uh, am I looking at Cap the? Okay. No, no. Ca Captain is sending. Uh, Car Carpet is sending to Red. Yeah. Okay. We got the first leak of the game again on Wave Three for. Uh... Yeah, Wave Three uh, can be a bit treacherous here, but we do have a Pota. And, Double uh, Wave Three leak, by the way. Yeah. Huh? Yep. This is gonna lead to the king, or is it? Yeah, this is leaking to the po king. Po Pota, this is Pota can uh, handle it though. She's not gonna leak. So we got first blood here. First blood here oh, for the <laughs> hammer. Is it for the yeah, the American American team. team? That's cool. We got our first blood on the wave tree. Wave tree seems to be like uh, 
Like a rewind of leave. every game we played today and every time back. <laughs> it's like, God damn. It, it does seem to be the case. Yeah, I agree. Wave 3 really uh, can be really treacherous. You need uh, you need to build against it. And uh, I like that... Uh, I like that we see the Pota here because Pota kind of really wrecks Wave 3. I like the mask pressuring. Oh, you see the sun right there. Is it is it gonna be? They they done an offensive at least. We can, we can give it. A, I think they're gonna try. It's gonna be imps. I would have I would have liked to see a safety mall on five. I think that would have been much better. Yeah, me too. They have no magic, like, and they have they have like they have a mask. They have an L razor. It's, it's pulling way for. They still leak. But, but barely, uh, you know. Yeah, it's not enough. It's not enough for sa saving four waves like that. Is gonna hurt your. Uh, it's gonna hurt your income. And uh, I think it'll go later in the game. They still, they still got like ah uh, ah uh, uh, what? Look at this. Whoa. What the fuck? Whoa. <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think we got the hacker on the <laughs> on the German team, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All Wait, right, what? let's see that. Okay, he's not going for a Leviathan build there. I'm a little uh, disappointed, to be honest. I'm but... definitely concerned about um, Carpet's build here. Me too, on Levi. Like, you can position your RP. Just position them in a way like the steed now is just giving mana to one of the trees, so no one's getting like really strong. Huh? No Leviathan two, you know. Leviathan carry pretty much seven and eight most of the time. Yeah, and he's leaking. I mean, he's got good card in his end. I think that's the thing is that people, not everyone knows that Leviathan. Aura stack two time because it's like the only aura that stack two time. Don't have any other aura yeah, that stack it, it two is, time. Yeah, it is. It uh, is. It is a bit. It is a bit uh, weird that we don't see the Levi here. But uh, yeah, let's see. Let's see how it plays out, though. Um, I like mean, that's the my problem there. The steed's the gonna get to the tight, middle. Though. Though. Steed gonna uh, give Night mana Saw. to the little one. Huh? Night Saw is playing a really good game here. They've got good push here. This is like a secret weapon for this wave. Huh? This is smart, and they're getting sent good. They're sending income. They're going income. Um, income seems pretty fair all around. We've got nine worker already for a nine seven. Yeah. I, I'm a little bit less worried. I'm li more worried about their positioning all, but I feel like Captain Jerk still have like all the cards to make good thing. And man, they are setting up really good there. I like that. The veteran on Wave Seven is like one of the best units you can get there. That or the new unit, I think. Yeah, I, th <laughs> I think both teams are playing a really good game so far. Cool. I don't like the pre-stress for this wave, though. It's like a nullified situation where no one's tanking. Let's see how it's going. Okay, they're going income. People, they're going in slow. They're going slow. And I like that a lot. Though. I think we're going to see a lot after 10 with their press the medium. Yeah, uh, press the attack is definitely an option here on the table. Uh, I think, I, I think with the way the game is going, uh, allowance might come into play. Like we might, we might see Captain Jerk going for allowance here. Do you think, um, with how slow they are going, they might even go lizard? Well, I, I think we want to look at the builds, um, in terms of like lizard, and uh, if I'm looking at uh, Torton Press. I wouldn't want to go lizard against him. They're starting to send a lot. Of... 
Like I, I don't think I don't think Lizard Army would do much against uh, Red's uh, composition here. I like however, how. Yeah. Yeah. However, uh, for the other three players, it could be used against them. Um, to to a, like. To to do some damage, yeah, it, it could do some damage. I agree. It, it might it might be a, a good uh, a good spell here. Hmm. Let me uh, see the Pegasus. I like how the German team, they are starting to... to oh my god, what? Oh no, okay, okay. I like how they're starting to set up to try to fight their castle there. Because you see the castle is a little bit behind. It's going to get back after wave 10. Yep. And uh, like I mentioned earlier, if he, if he does go uh, allowance, he'll be able to catch up both in uh, uh, fighter value and in uh, income. So uh, we'll we'll have to see what he decides to do here. There's a small uh, small leak, not too bad. Not losing too much gold. It's still it's a fifty gold difference there. Just a oh, 60. Okay, that no, it's seventy gold difference. We're still like it's just one worker difference normally, and he's going castle. So, but yeah, I and I think it reflects it reflects well uh, on their worker count right now. This guy is not clicking on them. Are we going? We're going to see income sand until things get serious. I think there, guys. Yeah, and we see king ups coming in from uh, the east team, the, the American team here. And uh, I like it, you know, preparing for the late game, getting your king up, your incoming. Uh, it's 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 good. I like it. Yeah, they're both taking their time there, man. They're both taking their time, man. And I just feel like him, he's gonna need the allowance like harder than any everyone else. So. Captain Jerk. Yeah, like I I'm really, jerk, yeah? I'm really concerned about. What is he gonna do on wave 15? You're right. Uh, his uh, his build doesn't transition that well into the late game. Uh, especially oh, he, the he could have gotten phase. in with the trap, like if he focused Leviathan. Because Leviathan are still like kind of like, let's say they can half tank, you know. They're still 45 Pierce with good HP in the beginning. I'm really afraid about wave 15 for them. That's all I'm gonna drop here. I don't wanna drop any negativity or all. It's 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 all I gotta say. <laughs> like I feel like everyone's like preparing for like they're preparing for 15. Double press stress, couple of PUE. Like I think 15 is gonna hurt one of or both sides. I wanna see the game. Go late game and a race. That's what I want to see. But I feel like look uh, at I this. I think we might get that. This I, I think this game we might get that because uh, income wise, uh, yeah, teal teal has kind of uh, fallen like behind. You know what I mean? Yeah, he's, he's getting back with the. I feel like with what they're gonna get, like the ups and down. Night is really holding this guy for Sherman. Sure, yeah, and and Castle kicks in. Yeah, that's Let's it. Let's see what that's cells it. they take. They're up now. Oh, press the medium. Oh. Everywhere. Okay, so okay. okay. Let We're gaming. Press the attack. <laughs> oh my press god. Press the attack all across the board. Look at this. Look at how much they've been eco there. So, uh, I'm assuming everybody saves here. 13. And, uh, we're gonna... Yeah, I, I think... Bye. I think... Uh, uh, Honestly, if I'm the, the American team here, I think I might try... And 400. 400 for know. the German team. They're going to go like... Oh, my God. Okay. I, I think 13 would be fine, yeah. I think it's going to be a big offensive there. <laughs> like, man, this, this is going to be the start of the mental game from the late game there. Oh, yeah. This is, this is definitely coming down... To, uh, oh, the next they're push. sending, oh, and... sending on twelve. Sending on twelve. Okay, everyone like sending Everybody. on twelve. Okay, let's go. 
Everybody's standing on 12. Let's go! No one wants to wait, they want to attack. They still have 240. This is gonna be a crazy send on 11. Then. Centaur, oh my god. Then. Look at all this. I think they're not ready to get that fight on no one. But even, yeah, this guy's really ahead then. Like, so like really okay, ahead. I think the only person holding here is red. I feel like the only person holding here is red. He's Look. got the, he's oh. got the boar. He's got the red eye. Oh my god, okay. This is holding for sure. Plus the butcher, the HF, you know. HF's really good at this point. Look at the yeah. value, minus 500, minus 400, like. Uh, I, I think this is where, I think this is where the German team is, is gonna this, take the, the big lead here. This is gonna be like, we're gonna see like something there happening. And it, it's going down. Going down for sure. And, oh, yeah, they're already, this is gonna be like 100% leak, I think. 114. 114, 94. 94. And the only guy holding? Red. Yeah. Yeah. Dude. He was ready with the red eye. The red eye did a miracle there. Man. Big big MVP this game for him, that's for sure. This is gonna fucking hurt there. Eesh. Is it GG? No, 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 it's not GG. It's not no, GG. it's no, not no, GG, no, no. not but, yet. Uh, they just got like 150 gold plus 80% of the king HP. That was a really good offensive. But look, let's be realistic here. Let's look at the big picture. The game's not over. No, no, the game right? is not over for sure, man. That that was the big send. Everybody showed their cards. Everybody knows Look at this, that they, they, they went to TA. Look at this. 22 worker, 25. They're not over with the attack. They're going to run 15, I think. Yeah, and I think uh, there's, there's really only one player that uh, kind of stands out this game for me. And it has to be red. Red is... is yeah, 13 freeze this game is He's uh he's just playing fantastic man. They're doing both their thing to be honest because I think Skyler on last game he went like super far behind and it a little bit like overthrew the game. A little bit like what we see with Captain Jerker right now. <laughs> man. Car yeah, car carpet jerk carpet jerker. Carpet jerker oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> I, I just I did the same mistake. <laughs> uh, I like that. I right. like that. Like that's oh, that's got really the dark color coming online here. That's really like he's got like he's got this line for like he's got these guy for fifteen. But man, he's got nothing for fifteen. Like he's getting a antler build. And even this lane, like, he's gonna get hurt. Huh? Oh, they're gonna okay. wait, they're we gonna finish the Levi. up. Levi ah, coming they got online it, the here. first one. Let's go. And we have a Millennium and a Trinity Archer here. And his positioning and all this is really, really good there. Even him, three Daphne and a Trinity Archer, Millennium. Man, this is really looking really good for a Gorbian abuser there. Man. But uh, I, I gotta say, this is this is definitely uh, uh, the type of game I wanted to see here in game three. They, they're fighting, they're fighting for sure. And again, the income is like off the roof in this game. I mean, uh, who, whoever loses here, they can be proud. They played a fantastic game. They they did fight a lot. Everyone went press the medium, and the game wasn't over. So you you know they're fighting when they when they do stuff like that. Uh huh. And um, it, it is it is to be noted here that uh, Thornton Fress only leaked fourteen gold. He only lost fourteen gold to leaks. So uh, yeah, there you yeah. go. Three hundred gold. Okay, this is the big sign of the game. He's got nothing. He's got nothing to fight this. So. Maybe uh, yeah. I think I think this is gonna be game, man. This has to be game. I think he's gonna. Is he gonna hold? I think even left if, side's even gonna if, hold, yeah. I, I don't mean, think even he. If Nazaria, even if he held here, he doesn't hold the second one. 
So I think it's yeah, the demon. Um, yeah, the shaman at this point is really tanky. That's GG right there, I think. Yeah, it was, uh, it was a really good game. Is it? The king's fully upgraded. I'm like, hey, 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 king got it! It's over. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah over. that's GG, that's GG. And so, uh, yeah, Grow Be an Abuser will be moving on to the semi-finals against Void. That was a big game for them, man. That was a big game for them. After last game, like, I feel like, um... Get you back. They, 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 fixed, they fixed their little issues from game two and came back really strong on game three. And, uh, yeah, it worked out. Uh, fantastic for the German team and uh, congratulations to them I like how they didn't fail let down by the last game before but their pick were really horrible man. like I, I don't want to be like the one who's like crying <laughs> about pick but like that was yeah, not the a good team yeah their picks were, were really were really rough they fought and they fought a lot it's just the well you gotta like the guy has less experience and stuff but I feel like he just fouled a little bit, but his partner were, was playing really good. Like, Night Saw was really, like, keeping them in place there. Is there any other game to cast today, or was it uh, everything that we had for for everyone I today? Think, I think there's one more game going on between Dunkler Lord and This Is Fine. Are you? It seems like they are in-game, however. Let me just check their score real quick. Let's see what's going on there. Maybe I can get the uh, the information for us. Okay, so yeah, I think that's gonna be it for the casting today. Uh, we've got this is fine, and uh, sorry, uh, yeah, Dunkler Lord and this is fine are playing right now their final game of uh, of the best of three. It's currently one one, so we'll we'll. Uh, We'll get our uh, our next semi-finalist here in a moment. And uh, yeah, tomorrow <laughs> we uh, we got a Void and Grobian Abuser playing against each other. And uh, Mubod versus uh, the winner of uh, either Duncan Lord and this is fine. Is this like their 1-1 one -one and their terminating? Like? Yeah, they're 1-1 one -one and uh, they're playing the last game right now. So, with what we saw between... So, it's going to be Void versus Gorobean Abuser. Yeah. What's your thinking? What's your prediction there? What's your take? So, I'm thinking with the way uh, Thornton uh, Fress played uh, in Game 3, I'm thinking he's got the ability to win the, the, the semis and uh, go to the finals. However, I would like... Uh, I would like to say that Void played a much more aggressive game. And so um, if if uh, Grub, if, if uh, Grubian Abuser don't uh, hold the early game and they leak too much, like per se on wave 3 or uh, on wave 7, stuff like that, uh, then, then Void would win. So... It's really up to them to see if they can uh, if they can hold those early waves and still income and find a way to victory. Uh, if I if I had to bet though, I, I think I think Void will take the, the next game. That's that's my uh, that's my honest opinion. What about you, Magdis? I feel like both teams play completely different gameplay. You know. Yeah. Like, yeah, I, I, agree. I feel like um, what we saw from the German team was like, we're going to feed you as much as we can, you know? We're going to send you no matter what, but we're going to be fucking strong in the process. Like, we're trusting that we want to, like, walk the walk and talk the talk. But, like, the American team, yeah. they were doing, like, send to make you leak. What they didn't have this game, the German team, is that no one made them starve. It was just like maybe two wave start like that. Like they can always push worker. Yeah, that's the thing. That that's that's where that's where I want to see. Uh, that's where I want to see Void take the advantage uh, tomorrow. Um, I really hope they find a way to uh, 
to find the the crack in the <laughs> in the German team, you know, and uh, yeah, pressure them and uh, make them leak. Yeah. I think that's the only way they would win. I, I want to see if like they're gonna be get disturbed by how they make you starve, or is mm -hmm. it just not gonna change their gameplay? And like, I feel like they have so much different gameplay that one or the two are gonna get in the, in this comfy zone. And just take the edge from there. Like, I don't remember. Yeah, I, I think if it goes late game, I would give it to Grubby and Abuser. Do you think, like, uh, they, they can be like, like if they go late, is if somebody was playing Castle, I feel like everyone was greed. Um. I'm sorry. I I didn't. I I don't understand. What, uh, uh, what it did mean. someone in the last four game when Castle, because like the. Um... No, I think the only I think the only player who was uh, playing Castle was uh, Carpet Jerker. Yeah. It was a good strat, and it's really like, I think the, the way. He built this, like, he had all the flying unit to make a flying combo, but decided to go with everything but the flying combo, you know? Yeah, I would have liked to see that as well. Like, the Levi with the Harpies would have been a, a good combo here. Um, also, yeah, I just got the Legion spells, that the, the Mastermind spells that they're using. Uh, Thornton Fresh uh, plays Agreed, and uh, Skiller 1L played Cash Out. That's so, uh, yeah, that's uh, okay. It, it's a good combo, it works yeah. well together, and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll just have to see if they can make the late game tomorrow. If if they make the late game, I don't think they'll be stopped, honestly. But uh, Void style was much more aggressive, as I was saying, and uh, better positioning, yeah, also, yeah. like the way, especially Gunner, like Gunner's gonna be, I don't know who's gonna be sending to Gunner, but this guy is gonna be tough to break, it's like. On the starving position, he went really good, you know? He was starving. Yeah. Now you're going to feed him. How? What is he going to do with all that gold, you know? We'll see. Maybe he'll. Maybe uh, they'll switch their uh, style up and uh, push, you know? If they push a lot of workers uh, and play the long game, I mean, only time can tell, you know? You think they can push and starve? Or... They're just gonna go like on the German way and be like, you know what? We're yeah, going like on all the German offensive way, you too, know? you know? Uh, uh, like, 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 like the Germans, man. <laughs> think, the I German think way. We'll have to see. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be like super offensive, super going. On. Man, man, I just feel. I feel. Uh, man, they, they didn't even get to wave 13, but I think everyone's gonna have to look out for a wave 3, man. Like, yeah. there's always somebody taking the edge on wave three, and like it's a twenty gold advantage, and it feels like it's a month in uh, to get on them. It will be a short night for Grow being abuser. <laughs> Lots of prep and tactics to discuss. Let's go, yeah, man. definitely. And you know, you're gonna have like uh, I'm gonna put the vods, so you're gonna be able to see actually how your guys are playing that you're going against. That's something to think of. Like the the VOD is gonna be there for sure. It's like uh, we'll be there. I can't, like, I can't wait for tomorrow. Yeah, me too. For real, man. It's like uh, we've got like we saw Void and Gorbian Abuser. What were the other team? Is it the first team we cast or? Uh, so Are they, do they survive? Th this is fine. Is is still playing their game. I don't have confirmation on who won. Shit. Uh, on the bottom bracket, we didn't get to cast any games, and so yeah, so we saw Void and we saw Gorbian. Uh, abuser play and i i did get a catch i i did get to catch uh this is fine playing uh, but what was the first team we played is the the first team we cast wasn't the russian team yeah the russian team but they're still there for the semi yeah they're they're they're, they're still they're still playing now they're playing their third game okay, yeah. i want to see them to double cash out against a team that goes starving and the other team that goes super income. I want to see that. I want to see, like, if the double cash out is going to cheese either of the strat. It, 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 depends, uh, it depends who wins this game. Uh, what I can do here, I can pull up 
one of the players and see if they've finished their game. Uh, no, so yeah, so they're they're still playing the game, but uh, if we look at uh, Garfield and Groft, which is uh, Dunkler Lord's team, uh, they play Fiesta and Castle. Okay, that I like that a lot. I think yeah, that's... so they played they played Fiesta and Castle, and they played Fiesta and Chaos. So they have they have uh, yeah. a Fiesta player on their team. So, so if we get to cast uh, Dunkler Lord tomorrow, we'll get to see Fiesta. If not, we'll have uh, This Is Fine, which is the Russian team. Man, I hope we get to cast, uh, like, out. all the series, man. For real, like, both of yeah. them. Like, I hope they don't play at the same time so we can just, like... I know it's gonna be, like, more time-wise, but if we can get to cast every team... Because I would like to cast both games. So then when we go to the final, we're like, we can make a real prediction, you know? Yeah. Like, real yeah, stuff. Yeah, 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 like, yeah. we can do with Void and because we just saw them play you know like we can do a little something we saw them play and we have both two games for them so yeah awesome all right, all right well thank you uh for having me make these it was a good stream it was a good series between all the players here today are you gonna uh, stream I'll or be, i'll i'll be joining you tomorrow on the um on the semis and the finals thank That's you sure. all for joining in the stream and uh watching us cast it's a it's a pleasure and thank you my guy big shout out to everyone on the chat that's for sherman for showing up and showing some love we love the energy that's what's keeping us man we like that a lot ah. the, the, <laughs> are you gonna are you gonna stream can i raid you with uh if you want to stream uh no i have uh, i have some things to do <laughs> yeah me too i'll be i'll be back later but uh all right yeah Thanks bye everyone bye for having us. See you guys tomorrow around the same time. We're going to be casting and putting our little take and commentary on the Division 3 tournament. Shout out to everyone on the chat. Shout out to Sniper. Don't forget to leave, uh, follow or subscribe oh. on my channel <laughs> or on my, this way, or on Sniper, this, like this, or on Sniper, Sniper TV, another big streamer of uh, my crew. The gamers crew but otherwise <laughs> we'll see you guys tomorrow for more commentary and we're going to be posting the vods uh for the for the contents for for everyone to see uh, what's going on today and our sassy comment uh, along the way <laughs> <laughs> have a nice day everyone we're gonna be uh, let's see well, actually maybe we can raid someone let's raid flight oh, you you what uh, never mind. I was gonna say, are there more divisions playing? But I think everybody's done. Yeah, that's what I. So I'm gonna raid flight, so you guys can oh, wait. have. Yep. No, no, there's, there's uh, cedars, for division two. Cedars. Um, can you just look if, to see if it's over or? Ah, uh, it's offline. Oh, okay, wait. Well, we're just gonna raid our old friend flight. Otherwise, I hope everyone has a good day and that I see you all guys tomorrow. Big shout out to my co-hoster Sniper TV. Have a nice day, everyone. Bye uh, bye. We're gonna be starting the raid. Shout out to everyone. See you tomorrow, guys. No. It's party time. It was a race, they lived by with 8%, they died. Oh no! And that's just how I lost my last game. Big Diz, hope you're doing well. Please? Yep. Thank you for raiding. Hope all is well. Lively raiding. Had a good day.